And welcome back guys, G Vids here. If you guys are new here, make sure you do subscribe to the channel. That way you never miss out on any future videos, streams, or anything fun like that. And we have the best and easiest glitch uh, we can do every single day. This is probably one of the best locations that we can do so. And this is Strawberry. You're going to want to generally stand where I am, just in front of that general store. Uh, obviously that's Strawberry there. And we're going to go down to online, click on free roam, and then and what we're doing here is actually for spawning in the entire city worth of collectibles so we don't have to wait for that certain day cycle to come here and grab maybe one or two items we can simply come here and grab the entire city worth of items now this only works for non diggables so I call the diggable items a little bit of a bonus item if they are here on that certain cycle uh, those are the only type of items that don't actually get for spawned in are the ones that are in the ground or up in the trees but everything else uh, uh, pretty much gets four spawned in so we can go ahead and grab the entire city's worth of jewelry and uh, tarot cards so let's go right ahead and do so and there's also a bottle of liquor in here as well and some other little goodies if you want to grab those I'll point them out as we get closer to them but this is the first item right here that's going to be four spawned in you're going to know if it's four spawned in because there will be uh, no indication that there is a collectible there and that's kind of why we make these videos it's not to necessarily show you the glitch over and over again but it is to show you the locations of each item since there is no uh, yellow blimp or vibration or anything to actually let you know that there is an item there uh, so you could be coming here for spawning the location but you're gonna miss out on a whole bunch of items which means you could lose out on the full set um, I do have a playlist down made up in the description box down below and if you do complete that full playlist you will actually have two full sets guaranteed plus tons of single items so if you've been out collecting already, you most likely are going to fill up some other sets as well. Obviously, that is the goal here to be filling up full sets, not just doing the area over and over again where you're going to only have 10 of those items. You do actually want to go to as many different locations as possible. That way you will have better chances of filling up full sets, which are actually worth way more money. And you also get the extra XP for selling those sets as well. So you get the XP for picking the items up and also when you sell the full sets so that way you are getting the maximum amount of XP for doing this as well for those people that necessarily don't have the role uh, you're not gonna make the money but you will make a ton of XP which is gonna help you rank up and move along in this game a little bit faster than you may be doing so and with those ranks uh, sometimes those things are locked up like certain guns and whatnot so ranking yourself up is definitely a key thing within the game and also collecting the cash as well obviously if you do have the collector's roll we go and sell these to Madame Nazar and if you don't you actually will hang on to these items so when you do grab the roll you're gonna be all loaded up with collectibles already and you're gonna be all ready to go to Madame Nazar and sell for some good cash now there is also a little uh, cigar over on the side there and then we're gonna be going into those rooms here and grabbing a few more items this location has a shit ton of items to it um, there is 11 on the bonus day such as today and then there's 10 every single day and sweet we're not filled up yet uh, do make your trips to Madame Nazar if you do have the roll because obviously if you do have 10 of these items You're not gonna be able to pick them up anymore and that way you're not gonna be gaining any more cash or XP for those items So you're just gonna be wasting time walking around uh, and finding things like this where you can't pick them up because you are too filled out on that item so do make uh, frequently trips to Madame Nazar so that way you can always make sure you uh, have a few. I don't always sell all of them. In fact, I make sure I don't sell all of them. I like to have a few of every single thing out there. That way you're always close to full sets and you can keep grabbing those full sets back to back and makes it a very, very profitable method. And this is the last item here, which is just a bottle of liquor. But I hope you guys did enjoy today's video and you did find it informative or helpful. If you have any questions at all, always ask me within the comments there. I am more than willing to help you out. Um, otherwise, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, make sure you do share, like, and subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next one.